today I will be reviewing Uze Mervai by Hermes. Um, I ordered a one ounce of this about a week ago. Um, this is, I think this is the front of the bottle. If you can see. And then the back has like glitter and it's of Hermes. It's really, really pretty. Um, I'm not sure if the bottle actually matches how this smells. Um, so, I purchased this based off of Mila LeBlanc's uh, review of this. Uh, I don't know. I don't even know if she did a full review. Um, I think she just included this in one of her videos. And on Fragrantica, there was some interesting reviews saying that this was like a fresh, woody, spicy, which I definitely agree with. And then some people were saying that it smells like sex or like lady parts or <laughs> whatever. Um, so I thought that was interesting. So I thought I would just order a one ounce just to see. So my first impression of this, our uh, first sniff, was that it smells like fresh laundry. Like it definitely gave me a fresh breeze, like outside breeze. Um, scent. Um, ooh. I kind of, um, I kind of traumatized myself when I first got this because I was so excited to see how it smelled I like severely over sprayed it this has the type of sprayer like the longer you press down the more perfume comes out the bottle um I pressed all the way down three times just in the air in my room and when I tell you like I almost suffocated like I I literally had to leave my room for like four or five hours just so I can breathe um, it's definitely a fresh scent it's but it's done in a different way um, so I'll just read the the notes for you the top notes are vetiver oak cedar the heart notes is ambergris the base notes are lemon orange LMI and pink pepper so, I definitely, I think on Fragantica they said uh, fur, F-I-R. Um, to me, this smells like pine needles, cedar wood, and lemon. Um, yeah. I definitely, um, I definitely get pine, um, pine needles um it took me a while to like pinpoint what plant that it was reminding me of but i finally got it and it's like pine trees like specifically like pine needles from pine trees um and there's definitely like a spiciness to it if you ever smelled pine needles they have like a certain spiciness that kind of goes to the back of your nose this does that definitely this does that um and then the cedar wood does the same thing. Like cedar wood has a spiciness to it as well. Um, whoop, almost dropped it. And I find that this pretty much stays the same from the time that I spray it till whenever it decides to wear off. <laughs> um, and some people, I think I've read a review on Fragrantica that said it smelled like baby spit. <laughs> which was interesting um i can see how someone can compare it to baby spirit or baby throw up or whatever they said um i don't know it's it's definitely a head turner like if you want to smell different and unique and you're and you're tired of like your typical fresh scents and you want to do something different 
um, then I would suggest go go for this. Um, this is freshness, but in a way of like a very woody pine tree way. <laughs> like if you want to smell like pine needles and cedar wood, then then this this is for you because this is like the probably the most realistic replication of a pine tree that I've ever smelled. Um, I feel like maybe this could also be good around the holiday times just because you know people cut down pine trees for their Christmas tree. Um, I don't know if I will be keeping this because I don't know if like when I think of like a fresh scent I don't know if, if my I don't know if I will reach for this one because I don't know I don't see myself ever desiring to smell like pine needles like that's it's just not really my style <laughs> um but the sillage is a beast the longevity is a beast like you will you can spray this probably half a spray and it will last the entire day um and I don't, I don't think you will need anything more than one ounce just because of how strong this is um it's definitely a fresh scent uh, this is i think this is supposed to be uh unisex as well i think i'm not sure um i'll double check but um i can see a man wearing this this would be this would be a really nice scent actually on a man this would be um different like a different but nice fresh scent um as for a woman like i don't know if this is your style if fresh woodsy spicy is your style then definitely go for this um as for people saying it smells like baby throw up um i didn't my brain didn't connect with that immediately when i smelt it um like i had to like really think about it super hard for me to be like oh yeah it kind of does but like off top i don't get baby throw up or spit or anything um Someone said it also kind of smells like fleshy. I'm not gonna lie, the first time I sprayed it, I, I did kind of get like a fleshy, like like what they meant by that. But the more that I'm spraying it, the more that I just smell cedar wood, pine needles, lemon. And maybe it's the ambergris. Actually, I have no idea what ambergris really is. <laughs> but that's probably what I'm smelling. Um, this isn't my type of fragrance. But I feel like if you were into smelling woodsy and fresh. And like this is your thing. Then this would be a great, great, great option. I think I will be listing this on my Mercari. Um, so if you want to buy this actual one ounce from me then i will link my mercari in the description below um so this is the review of uh Ude Marvai by hermes really pretty bottle um it's like it smells good but it's just not for me like i don't know how else to <laughs> explain it but it's it's definitely a good quality perfume it lasts super long and if you want to smell like a pine forest, then that, that's your girl right there. So thank you for watching. I will be uploading more perfume related videos. So if you're interested, definitely subscribe and like this video if this helped you out in any way. And I will see you in my next one.